everyone, I've done my best to recreate the makeup look that Deepika Padukone wore at the IFA Awards this year. So let's get started. We're going to start with foundation and I'm applying it with a sponge applicator for an airbrushed finish. I'm only applying one layer of foundation and leaving the concealing bit for later. That is after I complete the eyes. And now let's move on to set the base with some loose powder. I'm going to quickly do my eyebrows. Uh, hers are usually done thicker and more arched, but for this particular look, it seems like uh, she stuck to the natural shape and just darkened them. So I'm just going to do that. zoom in to do the eyes now. Uh, starting off with some primer, I'm applying this just along the crease and above it. Next is to apply an eyeliner as a base. Uh, that, that's why we left the lid space bare. I didn't put any primer on it. This also acts like a primer, so I'm just applying that on the lid and I'm blending it towards the crease. Notice how I'm leaving the inner corner area bare, but more on that later. I'm now applying a transition shade along the crease and up. I've been looking at all the pics that are on the internet. Uh, I've noticed that this eyeshadow look is only heavy on the lids with minimal color above the crease. So that's what we're aiming for here. Taking the same taupe liner I used earlier on a liner brush and I'm lining below my lower lash line and in between my lashes just about halfway. Taking an highlighter shade, I'm applying that on the inner corner area that I'd left bare earlier and I'm also taking this just under the brow. I'm now applying a metallic taupe colour on the inner half of the lid, uh, just beside the highlighted area towards the inner corner. Next, I'm applying a shimmery brown on the center of the lid, blending towards the crease and the outer corner. I'm angling my brush and swiping it along the crease. That way the color gets in to the crease area and above it as well. Finally, applying a darker taupe color, which is a more brownish purple. Color and I'm applying that on the outer corner of the lid. Again, my brush is held in that angled motion uh, and I'm also bringing that to my crease line and also above my lash line. Taking a clean brush, I'm blending the shadow around the corners. Next, line the lash line with black and smudge out the line with a liner brush. Also tight line the upper lash line. So I've been uh, looking at quite a few pictures of Deepika uh, at the IFA award show and the red carpet. Uh, I've zoomed into one of her pictures and noticed that the upper and lower lash line are connected. Uh, so I'm just going to do that as well and I'm also blending it out with the same liner brush. Mascara and some lashes and I'll be back. I'm just touching up with concealer and we're done with the eyes and now let's move on to the bronzer. Using a bronzing powder which is matte, I'm applying that below my cheekbones, along my jawline and on my temple along the hairline. Taking the same highlighter I used earlier, I'm applying that above my cheekbones, across my forehead and along the bridge of my nose. Let's zoom in for the lips. I'm using that same highlighter on my cupid's bow 
to bring out and enhance that feature. And now for that vampy lip, I'm filling in the entire lip with a burgundy lip liner. This also acts as a base in a way and it prevents the lipstick from wearing out. I'm now applying a matte maroon shade on top. And lastly, I'm using a maroony purple shade and working on the outline. And that's the look. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!